and the advanced code editor enterprise feature that we've added. So for those of you who like to, to use the source view of TinyMCE and, and manipulate HTML, you're probably familiar with this dialog. Uh, it provides you the HTML source, uh, but it doesn't really do a whole lot to make it easy or friendly for you to manipulate the HTML. If you're used to working with programmer editors like a sublime text, what have you, you're used to color coding and line numbers and all kinds of other things that, that we don't have here. So can I manipulate the HTML? Absolutely. But this view doesn't necessarily provide me a ton of assistance. Uh, I'm going to turn on the advanced code view now. And if I go into the source code again, you're going to notice a couple of changes. So first of all, uh, you're going to see color coding all through this. So if you're used to using tools like Sublime Text or what have you, you're used to color coding for tags and attributes and, and strings in the attributes. Uh, you're used to being able to do code folding. So for example, this table takes up a big chunk of the HTML on this page. Well, if I don't really care about the table, it would be nice to just kind of shut it down and not have to worry about it while I'm looking at the rest of the HTML. Uh, if I click on a tag, we will automatically provide you highlighting of the matching and tag, uh, especially useful with tables where it's really easy to get things out of sync. Uh, makes it very easy for you to see where, where an opening and closing tag fall in relationship to each other. So if you are one who spends a lot of time in code view or you have clients that spend a lot of time in code view, the advanced code plugin gives you a little more of an, a programmer editor-y kind of a user interface uh, to make it a little bit easier to manipulate that HTML while not having to take it outside of the TinyMC environment first and then bring it back. So that's, that's the idea behind the advanced code plugin. And, and as Jeff mentioned earlier, this is part of the enterprise product. So it, it is a commercial add-on.